Robot can perform brain surgery through the patient's cheek. A surgical robot can perform corrective epilepsy brain surgery in a much safer and less invasive way. For a percentage of epilepsy patients, medication is less effective at controlling seizures, or it doesn't work at all. For these patients, there is another option, brain surgery. This is usually a deeply invasive procedure, wherein the section of the patient's brain is either removed, stimulated or disconnected, afterward, recovery can take up to three months. A robot five years in the making by researchers at Vedar Bild University may be in line to make the surgery less time-consuming, less invasive and with a shorter recovery time. The area of the brain involved in epileptic seizures is the hippocampus, which is located in the lower regions of the brain. The surgical robot developed by mechanical engineering graduate student David Comer and mechanical engineering associate professor Eric Bath enters the brain from underneath by going through the patient's cheek, carefully negotiating gaps in the bone. This is not only a shorter route, it also avoids drilling through the skull. The working prototype involved the development of a shape memory alloy needle that is, an alloy that can remember its original shape and return to it when heated after being deformed that can operate along a curving path. The robot also needed to be able to operate it from inside an MRI machine, which creates a strong magnetic field. The resultant needle is created from nickel titanium, also known as nitinol an alloy that has both shape memory and is non-ferromagnetic, making it compatible with MRI machines. The 1.14 mm needle operates like a mechanical pencil, consisting of a series of concentric tubes, some of which are curved so as to allow the tip to follow a curved path to the brain. It is inserted in tiny millimeter steps that allow the surgeon to track its position by taking MRI scans every step of the way, and its accuracy, the team said, is better than 1.18 millimeters.